Tonight, we're learning more about a triple shooting in Randolph County that involved a two-year-old who was shot. Investigators say the toddler is in stable condition, but the two other people who were shot died. They were 16 and 25 years old. WFMY News 2's Itanise McMiller met a family friend who was in the neighborhood when the shooting happened. Flowers sway in the wind in memory of the 16 and 25 year old shot and killed Thursday night. They sit near where officers found the teenager and Eli Ganey outside the Coolridge Road apartments. A family friend who lives across the street says she was the first on the scene after the shooting. It was on on him trying to keep him from bleeding and talking to him and keeping him more like going back and forth between him and the other guy, which is Eli. Um, to um, keep compressions and keep keep them talking. Well, it was traumatizing, of course. The shock still hasn't worn off after the deadly shooting. You never would think it right at your front door. You know what I'm saying? It was your people's, people's that you deal with on a daily. The family friend also knew the mother of the wounded two-year-old. He's in the hospital right now, fighting for his life. He has, he got shot four times. Um, he's already had one surgery. Her and I talked just before she went to the hospital to comfort the toddler's mother. And she's literally about to lose her mind. Ashboro police did say they expect the two-year-old to survive. The toddler is scheduled to have another surgery on Saturday. As for the investigation, detectives say the shooting was not random, but these victims were targeted. Police spent Friday canvassing the neighborhood for information to help find who did this. In Ashboro, Itanise McMiller, WFMY News 2.